Every time I look around, all I see is art. art. Every day we working hard, we won't never stop. stop. No, we gon' keep on grinding till we hit the top. No, we gon' keep on shining just like we some diamonds. All right, all right. What we gonna try to do today? I'm gonna spur it with something, man. I'm gonna try to put some uh, screen print puff onto a transfer. I'm gonna see if I can make it real quick. See if I can, you know, see how it comes out. Just trying to experiment with something, okay? So let's get some ink on here. Let me use the black, some black puff ink from Marathon Supply. show it to you black puff ink for marathon supply okay we're just gonna use a little bit Ooh, it's thick too boy i think i probably heat this done up a little bit god dog. i don't want to put too much on here spread like butter on here y'all all right All right, I think that's good enough. All right. Let me get the squeeze it real quick. Be right back. Um, where my black squeeze you at? All right, we got one, y'all. We got one. So I'm going to spread it through here. So I might want to have to uh, heat this up a little bit, keep it warm. All right, you see how this goes on the, on the paper. All right, I just had to do it a couple of times because the ink is really thick and I should have Oops, paper came up. All right. Okay, we got it down on there. As y'all can see, uh, it's everywhere. So now I'm gonna put it in here. Put some nice old, some nice old sugar on it, y'all. Some nice old sugar on it. Everywhere. It's my first time doing this with the puff. I just want to see how it's going to turn out. All right. Got it all covered up. See that? Now, this is where I got to see how this is going to work. So, All right, so we got all we got all the, the powder on it. Now this is the the crazy part right here. We got to see about flashing it because you don't want to flash it too much that uh, the puff go ahead and swell up. So let's see. This like I said, this is my first time doing this. You know, so we're gonna see how it works out, y'all. You know, we're just gonna get it, give it enough to give it a nice glaze without. Messing with the puff, okay? Give it a nice glaze without messing messing with the puff, y'all. All right, don't raise up on me because it looks like it's trying to. All right, nice glaze. That end part right here. And I think we're gonna be done with it. It's trying to raise up a little bit on me. So 
Let's see, y'all. Let's see. Done. Okay. All right. We did it. We got a little. See, all it's, it's gone. It's like a little glaze. See the little glaze. All right. So let's go ahead and cut this off. Ah. All right, y'all. Now we're gonna go to the heat press, and we're gonna see what happens when we heat this up on the heat press, y'all. Okay. Let's go. All right, y'all, we over here at the heat press. Uh, let me get my temperature gun real quick. I told y'all this is very essential to the business. Make sure you get this, man. You know, all right, we at where we wanted at. Bam. Okay, man, make sure you get it, man. I'm telling you now. All right, here we go. I know y'all was waiting for this. Had to make y'all wait to the end, man, if I get some time. <laughs> you see how this turned out, y'all? You see how this turned out? I'm going to put a tough line sheet on it just in case. I know I probably don't need it, but let's see how it turned. Like I said, this is my first time, y'all. You see how it turned out? Let me make sure I get, get a nice, good pressure on it. All right. Ah, leave it on for 20 seconds. Um... Like I said, I'm, I'm just doing this by what I, well, I think I seen somebody else do it, but I wanted to try it myself. So I didn't get the time or nothing on it, but let's see y'all, did we do something good? All right. Got the tough line sheet. All right. Well, it got on there, it didn't quite puff. But let's see if we put the Teflon sheet on there and we give it some more time. Maybe got put more time on it. So let's do it again. Let's do it again. Because I think probably need some more time on it, y'all. I think it's longer, longer minutes for this. But it came out good. The ink came out good. We know that worked. Hmm. It didn't quite puff, y'all. It didn't quite puff. Let's see if we have it hover over. Let's see what happens. Hmm. Didn't quite do it, y'all. Hmm. Wow, I wonder what happened. Why I didn't puff up? Let's see. Maybe I posted. Maybe I posted it with a light touch to it. Okay, y'all. As you can see, it didn't puff up in the video, but I wanted to show you that hey, sometimes things don't work as you wanted to. But I always try to keep it real. Always try to let you know. what I'm saying hey, it doesn't work. I'm not gonna keep showing you everything that. Hey, that goes through, that's supposed to be perfect. So, hey, it didn't work, okay? But I tried it again on another shirt. It still didn't work. But then I tried it again on this one, and it actually worked. It actually worked, you guys. Let me see if I can uh, focus it out. It actually worked. It got puffed up. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm going to do another video uh, a little later. Uh, I'm going to perfect this technique, make sure I got it right. So I can start making some screen print puff uh, transfers and putting them out there, you know, for my customers, for those that want to, you know, puff some stuff down. I mean, I said puff some stuff down. I mean, put some stuff down, y'all. Hey, that's all I got for you guys. But remember, man, everything's not perfect. You know, everything not going to turn out perfect. You're going to have your failures, man. So you got to keep on working at it. And that's the whole point about me showing you this behind the scenes because, hey, Keep on working, keep on pushing until you get it right, okay? That's all I got for you guys, man. Peace.